What is your favorite business or marketing book? Probably the oh, Atomic Habits. Start with why? Yeah, yeah. There's like seriously three, but I'll, I'll say probably start with why is a really good. One. Your next five steps. Uh, if, if you're in a startup, I think the traction is a really good book to get. It's probably Tim Ferriss's Four Hour Work Week. I'm looking behind me right now. Um, I pulled it off my book shelf. Multipliers. Uh, it's more of a leadership book than marketing, but I think it's it's applicable. I kind of got some of the things I was sharing before, just about putting people in a position where they can be successful. It's called Creativity Inc. It's so funny that we're talking about creative on this show. Think like a brand out of bank. <laughs> Uh, Joseph Lewin, who you might know, turned me onto a book called Writing Without Bullshit, and we we reference that all the time. Influence is probably the one that I've liked the most. It's really good about, around psychology and the way that people, uh, you know, enter certain scenarios and understand how to make decisions. And then uh, the gift or the the uh, reciprocity is the word that's used a lot of times. That one's yep. really interesting, where you, where people feel like they're indebted to you for something. Uh, I don't know. That that's one that I'm reading right now. That's kind of top of mind. I don't think this one has changed. I think I still said building a story brand because it provided the foundation through which we do effective messaging. Probably obviously awesome by April Dunford. I have it like right next to my desk. I open it up all the time. I'm like, what would April say about this? Everybody writes. It's Anne Hanley. Okay. I just love her style. She's just, I find it really tough to get through most business books, but she's, she's really great.